Hello, Brad Fiesta here, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons. In the last episode, we went down here into Sabrosia, and we found the Temple of Seasons, because uh, that is this is how you get to underground. And uh, we got the Rod of Seasons, uh, and then powered it with winter. So now we can turn places that are any other season into winter. Uh, and in this episode, we are going to go east, to the eastern woods. Um, hey, it's you. That is it. Yes. You kind of look like a ghost. Yes. It only has the power of winter. That's, I mean, that's all I could really do for now. Uh, do I understand? Yeah, sure, whatever. Okay. I have to find... He was kind of boring, so I just sort of skipped his text, but, um... I want to get on this... Fine, whatever. So we stand, and now I have made winter. I also made some, uh... Ow. Jerk. Ice! Ice physics! Great. Made a Blastoise and an Octorok. Okay. Winter forest. Um, no, we're going to the eastern forest. We also want to get a uh, boomerang. Okay. I believe in this game, the boomerang typically can't hurt enemies. It just uh, paralyzes them. Up here we have... Oh, these potted plant deals. They're kind of annoying. I forget what their actual name is. Um, oh, gosh. But they are Danger Town. Um, hey, awesome. This is exactly... Not exactly what I was looking for, but that will heal us. And that will make, make our travels a little easier. Get back here. Get... Fine. Be that way. And now you are the dead. Um, let's go this way. I think if it were any other season, this would be blocked by this tree. So let's go here. Hey, this is new. Ow, you jerk. Okay, now we are fully healed. Let's get some bombs. And let's uh, blow up this thing because we are supposed to. Okay. Maybe this is some sort of puzzle? Mm, seems like kind of a dumb puzzle. I solved it! We have a lot of rupees, and we have nothing to spend them on. <laughs> Isn't that such a problem though, having disposable income and not being able to spend it? That's something I'm uh, completely aware of. And can relate to uh, fully and entirely. Um, sarcasm. So let's see here. Uh, east direction that we were supposed to go. I'm not ready to turn it into winter just yet. In here is the Sunken Falls. See, we can't quite swim yet. Um, see? So I don't even know why I tried. Um,. I want to explore a little bit more before I turn it into winter, as I mentioned. East! Hmm. This- uh oh. Santa, welcome! Okay, uh, that- that's a hint if I've ever seen one. Oh, hey! This seems like a really poor time for you to show up, because there's, uh... All this stuff is right here. I, there's no way I can reach all that stuff. Oh, I can. Perfect. I wonder... It sounded like I got a ring. Come on. No. Bummer. I feel like that's gonna be one of those, like, penalty... ...ones. Yep. So that was what, a loss of about 50 rupees for paying to fix his door. For shame. I mean, it was, it had to happen at some point, so... Uh, let's, let's actually do the Santa thing, since it looks like the seasons change between those two screens. So... Alright, so we are gonna get the Rod of Seasons. 
we're gonna jump on the tree stump and make winter. See that? I also blocked that guy's arrow with a with my sword. Oh, hey, let's uh, here we go. This girl's pretty cute. Hi. I yes, I am. Shovel, my, my favorite. Great. So we have been uh, conscripted to uh, we've been contracted to dig out the snow. Digging is one of the best ways to get uh, rupees and stuff, especially the ore chunks uh, underground, and also fairies and stuff. It's pretty great. Shovel is a great item. Done. Okay, so we were heading east. Um, we're gonna continue to head east, although not really because we are at the we're as far east as we can. So that was a good dead end. Oh, my head itches. Okay, die, Blastoise people. Typically, the blue uh, enemies are gonna have more health than the uh, red enemies. Hmm. This seems like a puzzle. A puzzle-ish sort of thing. We solved it. I'm wondering if maybe we shouldn't have cut that patch of grass before... Or maybe. Nope. Okay, well, whatever. Over here we have some, some more blastoises and bombs and stuff. Those are like some... I'm not even sure what type of enemy that is. We got Pointy Diglet. Oh, we can continue going east. Perfect. Hey, uh... Alright, so these are mystery seeds. What they do is a mystery. Um... But not really. I, I know what they do. So now we can choose which seeds we want to use in the seed satchel. And the mystery seeds will actually, they have like magic in them. And uh, you can feed them to the owl statues to get hints. Um, you can also use them on, you can't use them while you're standing on uh, those vines. But I'm going to hit this guy. Get back down here. Um, you, you butt. Ha! They can set people on fire. Hooray! Um, is this the second dungeon? Are we already there? Neat. Uh, one thing I'm going to do first, though, is... Uh, if you use the thing here... The vines only grow during summer, uh, but the ice is only in winter, so... Kind of have to try to balance that out a little bit. What a waste of time. There's nothing in here. Okay, thanks, Winter. Wasting my time. Um, Let's go inside here, then. This is probably level two. The Snake's Remains. See how this dungeon goes. So it looks like part of the puzzle is going to be lighting the torches to uh, progress. Something we can do thanks to our uh, abilities gained from our previous travels. Diglets! That was a that was a prize. I got the I got the prize. My mouse has been on screen this whole time. But I don't think my recording software actually picks up the mouse, so that's... That's alright. Snakes! Ekans! Oh, we definitely want that. Boom. Okay. I got a feeling that tonight's gonna be a good night. No? No, tonight is a regular night. I was just sort of a dead end with a key. So... In, in all possibility, that was probably the correct way to go at first. Now we go up. Alright. 
in here. Oh, okay, these torches spit uh, fireballs. So let's continue going up. Hmm. Wonder what this means. Okay. So we get, it looks like we got a few options here. We'll have, uh, once we defeat this guy, we can go left, or we can use the key to go up. No, wait, no, this is right. We can go right, or we can use the key to go up, or we can go left. Because bombs. Because bombs. Since because pickles. I don't know why, but I've re Oh, whoa! This is one of them secret rooms. Each of these rupees is worth some random amount. Um, between, like, what? That one's worth one. That one's worth five. That one's worth five. That's one. That one's worth ten. So I'm guessing somewhere between, uh, five and... Or one and ten. Just, it's a lot of money. I know they like to hide those rooms in various places. I remember there's one in Link's Awakening. Uh, in, like, the secret color dungeon. Let's let's not use the key first. Let's try going this way first. Oh, okay, this room is dropping snakes. Which makes sense. Snakes remains. There are snakes in the dungeon. Uh, I wonder who the boss is going to be. Okay. Symmetry! Wait, maybe it's this sort of symmetry? Yeah, that was a good prediction on my part. Um... Nothing there. I just want to be, you know, paranoid. Okay. In here. We're oh, goodness gracious! That does serious damage! What were we supposed to do about that? That is... Kind of annoying. Hey, there's a... That's weird. Oh, snakes! It's not prepared. Okay. Goodness. How am I... I'm better than this. Ah! Okay. Compass is gonna be nice. This is a single floor dungeon. T probably looks like a snake. If I had to guess. Okay, I'm doing semi-poorly. Um... So we need to figure out... This was the death room, right? Yeah. No, no, this was a- this was a safety room. Really wish one of them had dropped a heart. This is the danger room. Move quickly, move quickly. Okay. So there's the key. Think there's anywhere else we need to go in here? Yes, there is. Let's go this way first. Okay. Hmm. If that wasn't a hint, I don't know what is. Let us blow up the snake's remains. Good job. Oh, we get to do some underground side scrolling stuff? Neat. I'm really confused as to what, like, the item is going to be in this dungeon. There we go. Okay. So we got thwomps here. Whoa. There we go. That's the best way to do that. I'm getting, like, super lost in here. I... Great! We went the wrong way! We went the wrong way! Although I now know what the dungeon item is gonna be. Because that thing was too heavy to move, so we need to find some way to increase our... Uh, strength attribute. And, uh, we will do that... By going the correct direction. Yeah. Refresh our stack of bombs. And run. 
Okay. Nope, still can't do it. Can just stay safe here. Move silently. So the direction we need to go then is probably the only door we haven't tried to go through yet, which is this one. Uh, is this going to be mini boss? I feel like it is. We've explored a lot of rooms. Nope. Okay, so these guys, um, they are completely invulnerable to damage. Um, so you have to kill them by knocking them down into pits. Um, hmm. Yep, the clay pots are heavy. Can we go anywhere to the right? No. So, uh, nowhere to go but left. What's this, what's this all about? Okay. These plants uh, actually refresh themselves, so if you happen to do really poorly on this particular challenge, uh, you'll be able to increase your stock of bombs. Okay, that works. I would rather just straight up kill them rather than knock them into the pit, but... Oh, come on, that hit. Oh, what? That was, that was the best. That does it. Alright, this is perfect. This is the power bracelet. Um, if we equip our power bracelet, we can, it kind of looks like a croissant. So if we equip our croissant, um, then we are able to pick up heavy objects. I believe you, these actually, the thing I, no, they are invulnerable to damage. I think in some games, you can actually just throw rocks at them and stuff, and they will take damage. Okay. Perfect, the map. That's an excellent thing to have. So this kind of looks like a... Yeah, it's a snake. So you can see like where I'm at is kind of like... Right to the lower left is the eye of the snake, and then it kind of like coils. Neat. Which... Okay, down is the only way to go. Oh yeah, so in the eye of the snake was the uh, secret treasure hoard. Did I miss a treasure chest in the snake's head? I did. How... How do we get over there? Well, I will figure it out. It's probably a, um... I do like this whole snakes dropping from the, uh, sky thing. Um... Very Indiana Jones-like. Oh, goodness, I forgot this was this room. Okay. I would really love to get that heart. Even though it was probably a fool's... It was a fool's game. Foolish fool. Okay. So the power bracelet can actually allow us to uh, push this dealio also. But it will slowly roll back. So obviously this room is on like a slope or something. Why? Why? Whatever. Okay, so let's go this way. We'll eventually have to go back to that other room, too. Oh, come on. So let's go up. Oh, this takes us out to, uh... So now we have a shortcut uh, back to the dungeon. You jerk. So if this video were getting kind of long... Um, this might actually be a good place to stop it. Wait, wait a second, wait a second. Hey! Jerk. Is this where the mini boss is? If that is, then that's so cool, where you have to go out of the dungeon to get to the mini boss. Nope. But there is something important in here. Uh, bombs. Bombs is what we need. We have to use our bombs sparingly, though. I have a feeling this is going to be the right place to use it. Yeah. So let's, hmm. Maybe... 
Like, right in the corner here? Nah. Ah, uh, we should have enough, though. Oh! It's, it's time limit! It's on a time limit. Okay. Try this again. Oh, wait, no, we don't have enough bombs. Bombs. Nope. Give me bombs. 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 Oh, what a pain. Alright, let's not screw this up this time. I really wish I had done a much smoother transition when I first went outside. Um, because this is now getting to be uh, somewhat long. Like all these videos of this project have been. But, uh, oh, I would have had just enough. I didn't need to buy more bombs. Okay. Make it, make it, make it. We did it! Stressful. Okay. So let's get back out of the dungeon. Past the cruel... This is a Deku scrub, by the way. Okay. So what if I were to say that this is a good place to stop this video? And then we can continue the dungeon in the next video. Hey, how about that?